Welcome to another episode of BC's Dear Diary, but this is a species Spurs Diary, and of course, this is episode two of our yet to be named collaboration between uh, BC Spurs Diary and of course Singapore Spurs Supporter Club, the only official supporter club of Spurs in Singapore. Fu yo, Singapore so small. How many supporter clubs they need? Uh? <laughs> I mean, one is enough. Huh? We, do, how how many fans we have? Like two million. Close, huh? Close, huh? I mean, Singapore. Because coming to 3 million, the population went up to 6.04 million. Huh? I, I think most of the fans so in to Singapore 3 million. are Tottenham's fans. Quite, quite yeah, it should be all white. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we meet today, Barrow <laughs> Spikerman. Hello! Good day. <laughs> you, should have, you, you have seen him before somewhere else. Huh? I mean, he's the original Senkang Cockers. Huh? <laughs> Warm the cockles of, of my heart. Roll it back. Okay, so anyway, if you are wondering what I'm holding, yes, it's a real one. Huh? It's... La poo poo la. <laughs> Okay, anyway, today we are, we are, we'll be talking about what? Spurs, right? Spurs. Spurs. Tottenham Hotspur. Tottenham, Tottenham, Tottenham Hotspur. Hot oh, okay. Singapore, Tottenham. Tot- Tottenham, uh, Tottenham, <laughs> Tottenham. Okay, and uh, we are not sponsored by anything. <laughs> not so, yet, not yet. Not yet, not yet. Yeah. But hopefully, if anyone Beverage. sponsors us, uh, you know mm. how to reach me. Uh, very easy. Uh. <laughs> okay, anyway, today we will talk about Spurs. Okay. Uh, yes, uh, a few days ago, mm. Our chairman, yes, our Kong, chairman, and of course our mascot, uh, Ash, the one that always never wear Mr. the Ash, shirt, yes. never wear shirt, and then I uh, wear the cock head. You got the body for it. I also got what? Okay, uh, round is a shape, bro. So both <laughs> Ash and uh, Chairman they, Hong they Kong, went, they went to this uh, Spurs forum, right? Yes, with, uh, the fans forum, right? Yeah, with uh, Levy. Levy. Levy was there. Poster Coglu was there. Uh, uh, Johan Langer was there. And Bethany. Bethany, Beth, Bethany, Bethany, England, England, yeah. Beth, England. How English can you be? That's why it could be Johnny <laughs> Irish. Yeah, Johnny Irish, and of course, and also got... the manager for the women's team was there. Yeah, but, but we forgot one name... person, very important person. What? Who? Sunny Lan. Oh, Opa. Opa, you forget Opa. <laughs> I tell, sorry, Opa fans, we forgot many... about you. <laughs> but how can we forget about Opa? Yeah, I think because, he was the he was probably the highlight, right? Yeah, I think, Opa I think he Overload, was the you know. he was the main event. He came out last. Yeah, but time. the main event is one thing, but the mm. main talking point was the question raised by our very own Ash. Oh, okay. So he asked, uh, what is your I think what biggest takeaway or achievement or Spurs so far?" Okay. So, so he posted to who? He posted to uh the board to the the committee ah, or the, whoever okay, they're okay. talking to. I assume is posting to uh Levy. Uh. Okay. I mean, love him or like him. Mm. Uh, love him or like him? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I'm not Bro, that's still one side only. Yeah. <laughs> I, I mean, like I always tell people, uh, five for five for bad and six for good. Lah. Okay. <laughs> anyway, uh, jokes aside, so the, the three question, questions, yes. the, the question was, and his takeaway was number one, reaching the Champions League final. Okay, so that okay. was a highlight for Levy. Uh, yeah. Number one. Mm. I think it's also a highlight for most of our fans. Of course. Lah. Yeah, How many course. Champions League finals have we been to? Uh, one. Yeah. <laughs> under Levy, yeah. Uh. Under Levy, uh, mm. uh, no one else, uh. Then uh, number two was mm. uh the new stadium, beautiful oh, stadium. Okay. Of course, uh, it becoming a world class stadium, world class mm. concert. See, unlike Singapore, our national stadium, uh, I think also spend as much our money. Sports hub, yeah. uh, but when got any event, right, our grass or the road, uh, <sighs> that's it. No football. <laughs> yeah, it's so bad because it's just there, wa. Uh, you can't like. But you, you know why? What's uh, the problem? It's not retractable. Yeah. You know what's the problem with uh, Singapore Sports Hub? And, uh, I know. The weather. No, not so only the weather. Need. No, not oh. only the weather, bro. Then? Not built by Levy. Oh. Uh, the so project manager. Yes, exactly. Not Levy standard, right? Yeah, standard. <laughs> and of course, Set. thirdly, uh, the growth of our stars, so players the... like uh, Modric. Is it okay. Modric? No, I think Bill, uh, someone, someone, and Kane lah. I mean, sadly, all of them. Okay, so Bale, now. Kane. So was it like English or British? Uh, actually, but I only saw Bale and Kane lah. Bale and Kane. Be- okay. I mean, there's real more lah. It's Bali and Kani lah. So <laughs> the others, I I forgot who lah. But um, so, so what's he, your what, okay. what's your take on it? I mean, uh, even Fabrizio, I think posted something about this Twitter or, or Romano Twitter or, or Gramt, Gramt it. Okay. Uh, he was talking about it. So let's go one by one. Okay. Uh. Champions yeah. League final. Mm. Do you take this? I mean, we, we probably, if got fans of any other clubs watching, we probably get bantered already. <coughs> uh, that going to a Champions League final is an okay achievement. La, what what do you say? What do you say? I think it's an achievement to reach the Champions League final. Of course, you want to win the mm-hmm. Champions League final, right? But football is different. Like, if in other sports, you... Okay, in the Olympics, any sport, right? 
you come in second, you get the silver. It's like okay, you came close, but still like we'll celebrate it. But in football, if you lose the final, right? Hey, you're a loser, you're a loser. Yeah, nobody feel, yeah, but you nobody made it all the way to the final. Nobody like. remembers the runner. Yeah. Right? So I guess, okay, if you are Real Madrid, you go to the final and then you lose, then to them it's like, oh, we had a bad season or mm-hmm. we lost. But to Spurs, to go to the final, it's still not the result we wanted. Mm, I, I, right? But when you look back as Levy, you look back not as a player or as a fan, but someone who's building the club, then okay, reaching the Champions League final is a milestone. Like, of course, the, you know, What's next? Yeah, I mean, next is to get there and to win it lah. Yeah, but I mean, easier said than done. I mean, uh, looking on hindsight like if you can change mm. one thing about that final, what will you do? Oh. One thing, if you can change one thing. I think Kane wasn't fully fit, right? And Lucas Moura, like he got the hat-trick to get us to the final mm. and he didn't start. I think that was wrong. Like somehow, Morally Mora, wrong, Mora, uh. Mora, <laughs> Lucas Mora, Mora should have should have started the final. You got Mora yeah. not playing, so Mora not there. Um, <laughs> I think it's, it's ahead of like Sissoko or something, then Sissoko would have handball. Then like, yeah, the I mean, game would still be going. I on. mean, that was not a handball, uh, That was like bird ball. Yeah, that's right. That's, so the ref also is an issue. Ah, okay. Uh, okay, I mean, I mean, okay. Number two, a lot of hmm. our fans always are, number uh, two. A lot. I don't know what I mean, but a lot. Maybe like twenty or thirty of them lah. Like, they're okay. saying like <laughs> profits over honor. Or whatever. Okay. Profits over f- whatever lah. Mm. That uh, Levy is more concerned about profits rather than on pitch. I mean, I, I, I think we've covered this before. I, co- I, I tell this to anyone I have the opportunity to say that the only thing that I feel is um, buying players doesn't mean you have to buy big. You buy right. Buy yeah, correctly. You buy the right look, players. Look, our well. biggest signing so uh, pre-Dom, Dirty Dom was and Dombele! Tongi! Okay, for Spurs fan, uh, for anyone Tongi. who don't know, right, he was unveiled in Singapore. Uh. Yeah, his unveiling was at in... Singapore outside the sports hub. The hey, is it area. our fault? Why is it our fault? We jinx him or something. So he uh. can't handle the heat. Yeah. He can't handle, he, can't handle. He, he, I think too much chakwe uh. Bro, same, <laughs> as the, same as the Anthony Joshua. You all saw like got the video, oh, yeah. got the picture, right? He went up to the top of the top. No, 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 I, I, I need to I need to cover something. Uh. Uh. I've been sent this stupid meme about I went to I I went to I was post kid I won I went to the kitchen I can't even leave a cup up now <laughs> and about what uh, empty trophy cabinet hey hello hello football didn't start 20 years ago ah uh. okay as a matter of fact Arsenal fans we got more European trophies than you are uh. if you want to talk about no trophy you all shut up lah uh. let's shut up uh. shut up <laughs> okay so we're talking about Tongi no we're talking about stadium, <laughs> stadium. <laughs> How did the stadium get to Tongi? Okay, so you're going to buy the right players or something. Yeah, okay, oh. back to stadium. Like, okay, pride yeah. and joy of Daniel Levy. Of course, well, I've been looking at the stadium. It's modern world-class stadium, retractable, multi-purpose use, right? We use it for football games, the NFL games, uh, the concerts, and even un- underneath the stadium, there's a go-kart, uh, go-kart racing. Thingy, right? yeah, so so is basically, like... it's to maximize the use of the stadium. There's the there Skywalk also as mm-hmm. well. So it's just finding more use for the stadium on a day-to-day basis rather than just every two weeks or like how many mm. home games only yeah. 19 league home games the cups i give you also another six home games european maybe another 10 home games only 10 Out home games sh- european uh. what well, we go and do so far uh, i think uh, quarter final then knockout all. i don't like you <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay anyway talking about stadium. so the stadium is also a, another like it's good lah. Mm. I mean, right. the most impressive thing about stadium is we are mm. still at White Hart Lane essentially. Yeah. We didn't no, move. Still there. We didn't have to Yeah, move. we're not like some people need to like move across the country, move across the city. Yeah. Well, then they were, were high, were emily. <laughs> then what, what, they need to go and use a taxpayer's stadium. Oh yeah. So Spurs didn't get any money from so the we are not sell. Right? Uh, we are not sell out after all, yeah? That's right. If so, I'm proud of us, you know, be proud of us, you know, proud of this Coco, you know. Even West Ham is like terrible. They are leasing horrible. the stadium. And then, uh, the, the, and then because the running track is still there, they have to keep Uglies, it. Ugly, yeah. Mm. Like National Stadium right there. That's why they... Yeah. But cannot compare that to no, Singapore, Singapore, Singapore Nation. different. Right? La. I mean, our sports up in Singapore, we have to use it for all sports. For, for all all alone, events. Uh. Anything. Uh. I mean, the Pope also came. Bro. Oh, yeah. I was there, man. I was on the pitch. You were on the pitch? Uh? Yeah. We are, you, the, the, our stadium get blessed. He was blessed. He was blessed. 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 He's blessing the people of the stadium. The people. The people. That means the stadium's still not blessed. Oh, but the people were in the stadium though. Then the people after that left the stadium, (laughs) how many of them will actually go watch the game? Now we're going to bless the whole country. Never mind. I will go and bless the stadium another day. Okay, okay. Okay, next. Kane, Bali, all this. 
to a lot of people it's like mm. why is he even clicking credit for all this lah but then other people asking what's your pride and joy what's your achieve what you feel most your achievement then people want to say it's hey, none of your problem my Kanye become good it's actually Tim Sherwood that found Kanye oh Tim Sherwood uh. Uh, so what's your take on that I think of course Levy wasn't the one who found these players or scouted these players he was just happened to be there when they came through right <laughs> But of course, he laid the groundwork for all these people to succeed. Wah. Like he walked there, eh, can he? Yeah. Like, like he saw him on, eh, the, on the streets of eh, ba- North London. Eh, 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 Bali, hey, Bali. Hey, yeah. But I mean, it was under Levy, right, that we signed mm. Bale and, and Levy brought in uh, Komoli. Damien Komoli, I think, was the one who yeah, signed yeah. Gareth Bale and Modric that, that season and all that. I heard, I heard Harry, Harry went to the house to tell Bale to come instead of United. <laughs> Harry went and wanted to sell him to Birmingham. <laughs> Hey, or loan him to Birmingham. We were lucky because um, uh, Ekoto, Ekoto was injured. injured right? They had to play Bale at left back. Yeah, but boy. sometimes that's how football is, right? Uh, Kane broke through because Soldado couldn't cut it as the starting striker. And um, Kane, 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 started, Kane started in the Europa League games, I think. Yeah, mm. then Adibayo was there. Adibayo also, when he was out of form, then Kane came in and he broke through. So, Heng Sui, right? Heng Sui, right? So, uh, uh, we, I just have to ask you this. Uh, Riz, just a couple of days back, mm. I think two days back, uh, Everton just got bought over. Yeah, man. By the freaking Sands! <laughs> freaking By. I think so. Uh. Yeah, fr- mm. fr- fr- fried kins. Uh. Yeah, fried kins. Yeah. I think they cannibals. Uh, they eat Whoa. their kins. They fry it. <laughs> okay, okay, stupid jokes aside. Then people are saying that mm. um, we are under very bad management and all. I mean, let's not try to be anti or mm. pro in it right now okay just a simple question did we or did we not progress as a club not on field did we or did we not progress as a club under Inik? i mean we look back Inik came in when 2001 so it's been 23 years plus minus yeah right? under them right back in 2001 we were you know highest we would be seven sometimes we would be back all the mm. way in like 12 position, mm. struggling. There were some youngsters coming through, but you know, not very good. And I think even like Sol Campbell was on the way out and in the end, in the end joined Arsenal. Like it was Aye. terrible. Horrible. It was, I mean, Spurs were kind of slow to adapt to the Premier League. Like you look at how Man United, Liverpool, or even Chelsea were adjusting to the Premier League and Spurs were just slow under Alan Sugar and all that. So under Ening, at least, you know, now we are caught up and now we are one of the you know, top four, four, six, top four or five, six, six uh, clubs in there, right? So mm. definitely we have made progress. Of course, fans will want more, mm. understandable. But this is where we are at the moment. If you want in it out, sure. But who is coming in? I right? think so who? Yeah, Sing Xiong, Apple, yeah, Bill Gates. I, I heard it will be a conglomerate between NTUC, FairPrice and Sing Xiong. <sighs> Finest, huh? Finest. Finest. You don't know how to react to this, right? Finest, yeah. <laughs> okay, goodness. okay. Before we end this video, uh, what is your take on the season? Not, not the take on the season as in what is your prediction? What do you want to see from the season? At the, let's say many, many, year, many, many months down the road when we sit down again, we talk about the season. At the end season. of May, 2025. Uh, what, is your, what is your take on what you think you want our club to achieve? But it has to be realistic. Huh? Of course. <laughs> la. Okay, okay. To be realistic, right? Let's say we finish. We got to go and finish like third in the league. Okay? Because Man City will be around there. Like Liverpool. Yeah. Maybe maybe Arsenal. But we got we to gotta go for third. Okay? Cup-wise? Cup-wise. I want us to win the FA Cup. FA Cup. Yeah, I, I want, want us to win, win the, the Europa Cup. Europa League. If we win the Europa League, then it's great. Because we win mm. a cup. And then we qualify for next season's Champions League. And I mean, at, at the yeah. end of the day, the Europa League is still a very prestigious European competition. Ah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So, I, I think, you. I mean, we are well known for winning the UEFA Cup, right? Yeah. I mean, that's the 72, only thing. 72, yeah, 84. Only, only thing we can brag about, right? <laughs> Bro, don't forget our AIA Cup. Audi our Cup. Audi <laughs> Cup. ICC. Are we two-time ICC champions? Ah? One time. One but time, we yeah. are the... Current defending Comfort Delgro Zack I think Tiger Cup ah, the, Comfort the Cup Delgro Zick Gi- Giant Slash Stunt. Tiger Cup <laughs> All the sponsors are in anyway, there Anyway uh, I think that's all the, all the time we have with Daryl So 
Anyway, we'll be putting a, a, a little poll on our Instagram. Go follow our Instagram, uh, Singapore Spurs. And then I'll put a link as well. Uh, go vote on the name for this show. From that time, me and Elias, we were thinking about name. Uh, then we f- I forgot to poll. Uh. So actually, it's my bad. <laughs> it's not bad. too late. It's not too late. We still don't have a name. So we'll have a name for the show soon. And of course, watch out for our show. And of course, like, subscribe to BC's Dear Diary. And if you are a Singapore Spurs fan, if you have not signed up yet, what, what are they waiting for? I don't know where have they been i don't know under the rock under the rock yeah under the final boss yeah under the final boss you smell what the rock is cooking they can smell it man they are under him all okay. right once again this bc <laughs> this Daryl spikerman thank you and come on news plus come on oh.